Hi all my chatterbugs, how are you today? I hope your day went well. Mine went really well, other than me being tired and... I woke up this morning, you ever wake up in the morning and you feel like depressed or just irritable? That was me this morning and I don't know why, I don't know why people wake up like that, but that's how I woke up. I woke up like the world was hating me and I hated the world. Yeah, I feel better now. Um, I really enjoy the comments you guys are posting that you like my videos. Um, they're coming from all the way around, all over the world actually. Uh, I got one guy in Toronto and I know who you are who says that he loves watching my videos every morning, waking up to them, which makes me feel very good. That's why I do these videos, is to, to make you guys feel good. I wanna talk about, though, is you guys all know Bruce Jenner is trans transitioning into a woman. Now, I don't see any problem with it. In the past, even I have thought about transitioning into a woman. Uh, but I don't think I'd make a pretty good woman because I've dressed up in drag before and I'm not a pretty sight. I would need to lose a lot of weight and have a lot of plastic surgery. Like, they're born as a boy, but they feel like a woman. Which I totally can understand. Because it's all about the soul. Your soul is a female trapped in a male's body. That's what it's all about. I've had a lot of transgender friends in the past, and I've, I still have a lot of transgender uh, friends that I know that are going even through the operations and stuff, and it's hard. It's very hard, and it's a long process. So I give Bruce Jenner kudos for coming out to his family. I don't know if I would have done it the same way as he did. Uh, being married over 20 some years and then telling his family But he had his own reasons and you can't blame the guy for doing it I mean, this is how he feels and this is what's gonna make him feel right So I don't know if you can hear but there are geese outside of my house We have tons of geese around here the Canadian geese are everywhere they're so overpopulated and they're they're like on the endangered species list I think or something you can't like shoot them or anything well I think they're getting overpopulated I really do they shit all over my yard they chase my dogs my dogs chase them and you know what I think the what they should do is they should do hunting season for Canadian geese kill them and feed the homeless that's exactly what they should do. It would solve two problems. Homeless being hungry and Canadian geese being overpopulated. I also want to talk about this Britney Spears thing. Uh, you guys all know I'm a huge Britney Spears fanatic. And I guess last week she fell on... Now you can hear the geese in the background. I guess she fell on stage and supposedly sprained or s tore some ligaments in her ankle. And over the weekend, she was caught on the beach in Malibu without her soft cast on playing beach volleyball or football. Well, one of the two. And people are ranting and raving about it saying why is she out there doing that when she can't even perform at her concerts well you know what you try doing what she does every day and I think she needs a break maybe she needed a little break literally a little break the girl can perform I've been to two of her concerts and the girl can really perform. She might not be the best vocalist, but she performs her ass off and dances really well. So just leave Britney alone. I mean, let her be. She'll be back. Don't worry. She's got that new song out with Iggy Azalea, which is mm, okay. But oh, and I also heard a new Nicki Minaj song, but I can't remember the Dean to the song 
It's really good though. I don't always like all of Nicki Minaj's songs, but this one was really, really good, really good. So, oh, freaking geese. I swear, I'm, I'm gonna shoot them. They bugged the hell out of me. Well, anyways, I think that's all for today's video. If you liked my video, you know, just press the like button below. Please leave your comments below. I always love your comments. And I hope you have a glorious day. And I will talk to you tomorrow. Love you guys all. Bye.